attract investors to the country. Recently, Mr. President was on several trips abroad. Each time the President is there, he meets the international community. Because of our size, because of the need to provide infrastructures, provisions of amenities, government and the President meets international partners and stakeholders. And that's why I am saying here, because of security of lives and property, government is doing everything it could to ensure the success of their country. It is instructive to state that between 2015 and 2022, Boko Haram has degraded significantly. They no longer carry daring attacks on government facilities and public institutions. Suicide bombings, and, suicide bombings and common, or it was a common occurrence in the country. <coughs> uh, I will interject here to say that uh, as a national security expert, we basically have five domains of security and government has been very, very effective. For those of you who want to write security of the infrastructure of government, NNPC, ETC, security of the country, the boundaries, security of the citizenry, security of the apparatus of government, churches, mosques, ETC, and of course, civil security. You can see that government is doing its best to get these results. People can now carry out their activities without fear of bombs. The massive military onslaught launched against terrorist groups by the Army and the Air Force contributed immensely to terrorist groups surrounding, surrendering their weapons. Many internally displaced persons have turned to their homes in the Northeast, especially in Borno, they actively engaged. My prof just said something here. Very content point. He said, irrespective of the fact that Nigerian security is overstretched, yet they have achieved a significant goal. They've achieved, you know, a goal that it will be difficult for anybody to write off. This morning, I'll briefly talk about what security and human, human the right of humanity is. And the paper I have here with me is strictly about examining what human rights is all about and the role of security in the management you know, of human rights. This paper is aimed at examining what is human rights and what constitutes human rights violation. The analysis of various human rights violations in Nigerian and by Nigerian security agencies. The paper shall also look at circumstances leading to such violations as reported by the media and other international you know, bodies. What is human rights? What is human rights? And the question here is, it is that right that every, precisely Nigeria, that every Nigerian is entitled to the right to life, the right to freedom, the right of association, and the right to space. Even it, it expands to the, light, to, to the right of interaction. But yet, we find space, we find lacuna, we find challenges when we try to exhibit our right to an extent. There are a lot of issues, and if I decide to go through it, you know, in detail as this paper is, I'll, I'll give the paper to um, the organizers of this program, 
which is very detailed. One of the, one of the things I prefer doing is that I don't, I don't go through scripts when I present my papers. I'm a teacher, and I, I like talking. I like teaching. I like impacting. So I'll pick some cogent points here. We are all entitled to rights. But what